the tournament has been running since 2001. This is now the eighth annual tournament. Um, we'd been to a tournament in America and came back and saw there was no tournament in Glasgow, so we decided to start that with the support of Glasgow City Council back in 2001. It's expanded to this year, whereby this year we now have the facilities such as the uh, new Tory Glen facility, the full support of the council, and this year we would expect probably about 110 teams to be turning up. Each team would have maybe a squad of 20 players. So all those kids, that's over 2,000 kids playing football on the new facilities at Glasgow City Councils. Well, I think we've got to do everything we can to encourage young boys and girls to, to play football, first of all. And I think when you can get an organised cup such as this, then uh, which is open to, to everybody, basically. And I think, uh, although it's based in Glasgow here, uh, I notice that there's uh, teams from all over Scotland, so I think that's a great sign. And uh, as I say, just to generally to encourage boys to, to get out and play football and, and to do it in an organised fashion, I think, helps. Well, hopefully this is just the first step, uh, the first indoor, full-size indoor pitch in, in Scotland. If you, if you look at uh, countries relative to our size and even smaller, in Scandinavia, for example, they have uh, you know, sometimes 20 to 30 of these in, throughout the country. So I would hope that that's something that will uh, eventually happen here. But it's great to have this one available to us in Glasgow and in terms of the, the Glasgow City Cup which is normally held at Glasgow Green just down the road. This is going to supplement that facility and, and I think, if, if I'm honest, I'm sure all the teams will want to try and make sure that they get at least one game in here because, as I say, it's such a great facility.